Yo, what's going on, guys? Today, we're trying out Pacific Drive. I don't know a whole lot about this game, but it's been reviewed pretty well by a lot of people. It came out earlier this year, but it's like a, a survival car game where I have to, like, maintain my car and drive through the woods. And I think, like, para not paranormal stuff, but just weird stuff happens. Uh, apparently, the less you know about this game, the better going into it. So, yeah, I really didn't research a whole lot of it, but it was on sale on Steam today. So we're going to be playing that. Um, so yeah. All right, let's get into it. That is a crazy message, boys. That is insane. What is this? Memorable routes. In Pacific Drive, the game saves when you load into a new level. You can save during a trip by leaving the current level, triggering a save. Manual save is available in the pause menu from the garage. So you can save during a trip by leaving the current level. Leave the level? You can also you can also abandon your trip from the pause menu to return to the garage. Triggering penalties and a save. Okay. There are options in the settings to modify these penalties. I don't know how much I want to be penalized for just trying to have fun, but we'll see. Would you like to customize your settings before you start? You can adjust these at any time during gameplay. I wonder if there are like recommended settings. Car protection, protect player when car doors are closed, restore. Oh, I'll just leave it. We'll just leave it defaulted. All right. You prefer using a laptop over a PC? I think it depends. Me, sometimes I feel uncomfortable using a laptop. Insane message for the YouTube intro. All right. In 1947, the Olympic Peninsula became the staging ground for a promising new technology. As rumors of its utopian creations spread, so did stories about overnight evacuations, unsolved disappearances, and unnatural encounters. In 1955, the government walled off a section of the peninsula to establish the Olympic Exclusion Zone. For 30 years, the zone's, the zone's borders grew until the government withdrew and sealed every access point. Okay, so the Exclusion Zone has been growing for 30 years now. What happened inside was never disclosed. So I think we're driving into there. Perhaps. JS Express. Let me know how the volume is, guys. Delivery details. Also, like I'm a delivery driver. The Olympic Peninsula, 1998. Wow, the, the year I was born. Hey, is the music copyright free here? South of the Barrier Wall. Can I pause? Let's pause for a sec. All right, I just quickly checked and there was copyright music, so I turned it off. So we'll see if that song that was just playing continues playing. It didn't. I got to double check again. Maybe it turned off. Hold on, hold on. Audio. Stream is safe mode. Disable copyright music from playing on the car radio beautiful all right let's see oh i just made that really loud all right let me know how that audio quality is guys uh volume sorry not quality so we just we just oh 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 i'm already crashing sorry just looking around what have i got in here what's over there Wait, I have a map? No. Oh, this is so cool. Wait, I look so scuffed. This is cool. Okay. It's kind of cool that they have like music and it's not copyright. It looks cool, right? How are you, Fez? What's this wall? Oh, this must be the containment area. Holy crap, I can't drive, though.
I can't decide which side of the road to drive on, Drew. Is there like a break? I'd imagine this might be a controller game. Wait, logbook L, J. Turn my lights on, true. No, I just see it. Yeah, I said I had lights. I'm gone on this turn. Oh, can you play this game with an actual steering wheel? You'd have to be able to know. <gasps> I'd actually buy one for this game if I liked it enough. What did that say? Oh, I'm fucking flying, bro. Oh, I'm flying. What's that sound? Oh! oh! What did that say? Warning. Launch and construction facility ahead. Periodic volume warnings. 80 plus decibels, next 15. Wait, my, my radio died. Well, okay, I, I can't read that at all. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Am I stuck? Oh, I got a horn. Oh, I thought that... What the... F what was that? Wait, I thought those were buggy textures. I think that was real. Interesting. I've never seen... Okay, I don't know what the, the brake button is, so I, can't, I haven't been able to brake. That's why I'm, I don't look like a good driver. They didn't tell me. Yeah, that's true, JC. So what is all this? Oh. Oh, there's no support. Whoa! Oh my god, this Jesus Christ. Okay. I'm getting sucked. Okay, imagine that happens to you in real life. What would you do? Not say I'm getting sucked. I think honestly, I'd be in so much shock. I'd have to say I'm getting sucked right now. I'd have to say I'm, I'm technically, uh, technically getting roadhead right now. The Olympic exclusion zone. Okay. Fine transportation. Is this my car? My car just break apart? What's that sound? Oh! It's like Fallout. Continue going. Do I have a slide? No slide. It's kind of like that movie where Dwayne the Rock Johnson drives those kids to the top of the mountain so the aliens can take... <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, it's just jump. Oh, kick. Ah. Oh, it's an eat to interact game. Oh my god, I just completely- I, I almost completely just restarted. Give me one sec, guys. There we go. All good. Okay, that might Hello. mess me Hello. up later down the track. Hello. Tobias? Hello, someone out there? Could have sworn, never mind. Francis, the radar's acting up again. You were supposed to tune up this piece of junk years ago. 
I can talk to a car? Sorry, guys. We're just going to... I'll make the subtitles a bit bigger for you guys. Do we have a subtitle size anywhere here? Subtitles on. Or are you guys okay with the subtitles that uh, that size? Wait, is it inaccessibility? Vision, weather, convenience. Am I dumb? Am I dumb? Am I dumb? I think I might be dumb. Okay, I'm just stupid. I can't find the subtitles. Like, I see subtitles there, but... Yeah, I fear I'm dumb. That's what's thank you. That's a, that's a good one. All right, it's fine. Don't worry. Maybe this game has decent, like, volume. Um, so was it the car talking to me just then? <laughs> Give your car a few swift kicks. Maybe it'll help. <laughs> the, the first thing I tried doing? Kicking the car? All right. Can I push it? Oh, put the wheel back on. I just saw that. Okay, hold on. Where is the wheel? This one. It wasn't the wheel at the very start. Oh, yeah. Oh. Start the engine. Turn on. Put it in drive. Do I have to do that? Located in mid zone sector B. Do you read me? I'm picking up your distress signal in the outer zone. It looks like you're somewhere around sector E. Hey, Francis, come here. Yes, it's urgent. Leave that interferometer alone for a second. Something is out there. Okay, so that, that's my, my radio talking to me. This car is cooked, by the way. Hey, we got a live one. Hey, do you copy? Working. Is there any way for me to? They don't have a transmitter. We won't hear a thing back. Huh. But if they're stranded, could they mean they're from outside? They're a preacher. Hey, hey, how did you get through the barrier wall? No one's gotten into the zone in ages and lived to tell about it. And if we don't get them to safety, this one won't either. That's a good point. Hey, hey you're in serious danger. The instability's closing in, and it's gonna scramble you quicker than beef in a blender. You close the shelter is a few miles east. Get there however you can, and be quick about it. Okay, drive east to find the shelter. Okay, we, we have a little compass. And I, did I just run out of gas? Siphon fuel? Should I turn it off? Oh, it's already off. Check your trunk for a fuel can. It's like the Fortnite zone. Oh, take fuel can. Dude, what is that sticky? H how do you... Oh, guys, I'm not a car person. Siphon fuel? Do I gotta like... Oh, I'm pumping. I'm pumping this. Suck it out. I thought I, I thought I was gonna have to do that with my mouth. Build my tank. Oh, this is pretty cool. Call me tank? I've seen someone siphon fuel with their mouth before. I think it was a very rough neighborhood. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh! Hey! Hey, hey, hey! Chill! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hello? Hi, can I drive through this? Oh, am I dead? I'm dead. I died. Oh, wait, hold the phone. There it is again, that blip on the spectrometer. I've seen that waveform before, but where? No kidding. Could it be? A remnant? That can't be. There hasn't been one in decades. Look at that spectral fingerprint and tell me that doesn't match the remnants exactly. No, no, no. What, what, what we should be looking at is how fast this preacher seems to be moving. Huh. You know, if I didn't know better, I'd say they're going about the speed of a... No way. No way to not tell me. 
I'm going crazy. I'm going crazy. Hold on. Boy, I've killed to know how a combustion engine's still chugging away out there. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. First, the breacher needs to get to safety. Then we can look into whether that car is a remnant or not. In my heart of hearts, I already know. Then back, baby. So, is a remnant something from the outside of the zone? Let yourself in. I hope he ain't gonna like you poking around in there, but better to face a bad side than let the zone eat you alive. I think a remnant might be something from the outside that still works inside. Uh, we have to go east, I think so. I think it's still this way. Hold on. A reef? What is a reef tank? Oh, so, uh, have a tube suck a little to create flow. Okay, that's what I've seen. Okay, we, we still have to head east. Is it east to the, to the right? No, because we were heading south just then. If we were heading north, then yeah. But we got our little compass here. Yeah, we got a tiny, tiny baby compass here. I'm going west now. What the heck? Okay. I'm lost. I might turn the in-game voices a little bit higher, but I think they're linked to the, the radio. Oh, this is it. We're here. Oppie's auto shop. Oh, wait. Did my wheel fall off again? Wait. Okay. That's not good. Um, find a way into the building. Let's see. I I should turn the car off. H how did my wheel fall off? I don't even know. Uh, the sound design is really good. Give me one sec, though. All right. I got like a, a smear of something on my left here. On the left of my screen. I don't know what that is. Do I have like a torch or something? I have to find a way into the building. My my objectives are in the, the top left of my screen. Oh, hello. Turn the power on, flip the breaker switch. Oh, bad. Okay. Oh, God. Who's there? Oh, the shop. Oh, God, it's been breached. Oh. You've got five seconds to get the hell out before I... Oh, my head. Uh, it's an emergency broadcast. Hello, uh, okay, thank you. This message is for Dr. Ophelia Turner. We send a preacher to your garage on a... Official zone business. Now we have it on very good authority that this person is in possession of a remnant, which has taken the form of a car, and well, uh, oh. get off the remnant thing. She's not gonna care. Um, uh, right, like I said, super official zone business. Protocol uh, demands that you keep them alive until we can get them to safety. Now, if you do not comply, I will occupy this broadcast channel with a recitation of the entire collection of poems I've personally written. That's 10 years and 17 volumes. And <laughs> Dude, the voice is familiar. So, another breach, huh? How do you? Outsiders not understand that Arda didn't build that 300 meter wall. I don't think I have to move that. Fun. Unless you're one of the unfortunates who got zapped through. Wait, I just remembered. I don't give a damn why or how you got here. You're trespassing, and I'd kindly like you to get the hell out of my zone. Huh. Oh, God, unfortunately. The barrier wall is as fortified against breaches trying to get in as it is against anyone or anything trying to leave. We have to find you a way out. So you might as well start by fixing up that car. Just don't break anything in my shop with those soft hands of yours. Oh, soft hands. Okay, so yeah, we're trying to figure out a way out. Wait, I can lock the door? That's so cool. Can I? It looked oh, like I could. What? Oh, you need help? Well, there's a headset somewhere oh, no. in the garage. Put it on. The built-in diagnostic will tell you what needs fixing up. A headset in the garage. I don't know what Moira sounds like in Overwatch, so I wouldn't be able to say she sounds like uh, Moira. 
This thing? I'll pick up the backpack first. Okay. Put on the mechanic's eyes. Ah, so now we get HUD. Very cool. Okay, and I can switch what I'm holding. I think I can probably hold this tire now because it wasn't letting me pick it up before. Nope. Okay, I was trying to kick the tire. So we have 36% health. Tend to my wounds at the first aid station. Okay. Well, what if this game turns me into a car person? Put the wheel back on. Bet. Okay, I did. It. I made my job a little bit easier by by kicking it over. All right. Okay, we're gonna pop this back on. Very nice. The parking sensor. A crew door. Craft a replacement door. Headset OS. Is that is that? What is that button? Oh, is that tab? That's what tab looks like. Damn, alright. Oh, cool. Okay, so it's like, uh, I mean, I think a lot of survival games have backpacks like this, but this is, I mean, it reminds me of Resident Evil. So blueprints. Oh my god, there's a lot. Uh, so crude door. This weary, flimsy piece of oxidized metal will both open and close. <laughs> Damn, that's a very crude description. It will also keep out the wind and the rain. It just barely meets every technical specification to be a door. So pin the checklist, so... Oh, pin the checklist you. one. All right, but... Yo, Jordy, thank you for the resub. Jordy, how are you? Hello. Whoa, T3? Dude, Jordy forgot to turn that shit off. Uh, how are you doing, Jordy? So I have to make a, a, a crude door. Gather items from the abandoned car behind the garage for your checklist. How can I... Okay, so if I have this blueprint up and I have it... Pins. Pin the checklist. So I, I need all of these things. Is there another way to see it? Can I go back to 2-1? Not telling. A crude panel. Okay. Search the toolbox in the garage for a pry bar. Okay, toolbox. I can probably pop that here. Oh, we got some tape as well. What is this? Mechanics kit. All the most essential items and equipment that allows a mechanic to do their job. You want a few of these on standby to handle engine or wheel trouble. Okay, I guess I'll take everything. Have you seen this game before, Jordy? Okay, so I should be able to open this now. Wait, open inventory. Do I have to move this into my hand, perhaps? Hands? Ah. Okay, cool. Okay, a road flare. Glass shards. Road flare, can I stack that on top? I can. Glass shards can be stacked. Okay, it's pretty cool. I like that. All right, let's see. Gather items. And the dumpster. Dumpster diving? Whoa, whoa. Why'd it do that? Oh, it like spits stuff out. Scrapper. Another road flare. Nothing. Can I hit this? All right, let's see. What is the scrapper? What is this supposed to do? Tear into anything and everything out there with this voracious homemade tool. Reduce items to raw materials in moments and walk away feeling mighty. Oh, okay. So it's a um. Oh, it's like a uh, like a like a pickaxe. Four times twenty-five versus five times. It's pretty bad, yeah. Honestly, Wing, I think Twitch is doing it wrong. Increasing the price of subs, I think is a cent like it's, it's probably going to be dropping the amount of people that are actually subscribing or gifting subs. It's pretty troll. All right, hold on. Let me see. I hope you're doing well, Wing. Craft a replacement door. Okay, so we have to place all the items. Uh... Hold on. Behind the garage. Oh, hold on. I got to scrap the car. Let's see. Oh, okay, okay. Does this scrapper ever, like, run out? I assume it probably would. Okay.
It's weird, like when you... Wait, can I siphon this? Should I siphon the fuel tank? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure we get our fuel. Thank you. All right. Would that explode if I break it? Oh, you can't even break it. Okay. Wait. So it's weird. I wonder why... Oh, that's like probably the last... Like the health bar of the tire there might be the last... Um, like when the, the tire is still a tire, but it just won't be able to be like used. All right, so we got a bunch of materials there. Where did those go? <laughs> okay. Oh, we have a to-do thing here. You guys can't see it, but it just basically has all of my, um, the stuff I need. Okay. Um, the crude door. Craft. Okay. Three, sorry. Okay, so I think this means I have one in my house, one in my backpack. And th like three on the car total three wait what all right we'll figure that out we'll figure the hot out it's true cool get the repair putty from the locker repair putty when you don't have the time or resources to perform extensive repairs this is this this is the spit and tape solution spit and tape whoa why why spit I haven't heard of that, uh, that phrase. That will carry you through and fix up the worst of things. Okay. Well, that's big. Uh, conventionally known as a spare tire is really a whole entire spare wheel. Still, who wants to break with convention and start quibbling over details? That's fair enough. Another bat, another, uh, heel. Um, chemicals, the sort of domestic substances that are only normally inert. But waiting for a household chemist with a dangerously narrow amount of knowledge is truly... Uh, so to truly bring them to life. Uh, September, you mean? Um, the September uh, stuff they have is... What is this? Trunk crafting. It's pretty underwhelming this year. Hold on. Blueprints. What? Uh, is that just like... Where do they want me to go? My logbook? In car controls? There's a whole lot here. Holy moly. There's a lot to learn. There's a lot to learn. Um, Let's equip our, our putty is actually what it's saying. Is this not repair putty? Oh, I need to find a place to put this now. Wait. Hmm. I gotta organize this. Steel sheet? That's so big. Uh, how do I rotate this? Ah. Uh, Damn, that's so big, man. Are we are we being serious here? There we go. Okay. Oh, it was there the whole time. I'm I'm griefing. I'm. Tr Why won't they go on my hands? Can I not equip it? Assign quick slot. Is this in my quick slot now? Wait. Huh. Wait, I didn't really get that. Okay, that's fine. Crude door. Is that to remove it? What's up, Shadow? Drive these. Aha. Uh -huh. So it's on, the, on all the stuff that I hadn't put down. And that, that's fixing it? Okay. So it's like a, like a ba yeah, it's the band-aid fix. All right. Cool. Let me hold the flare out again. Kind of weird it wasn't letting me equip this. Unless it's, oh, it's right click. It's right click. I, I, I was griefing. All right. Uh... All right. Oh, I still had a little bit more to repair. 
Although it's it's right quick right right click, but I also don't get it there. Hmm. I think there was one more thing. What is that? Lift it up. Oh, on the engine. All right. Is that good? Bro, I'm uh, missing something. Hold on. Ha ha ha. Wee 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 wee. There we go. All the ties. I think it might get like a little bit more complicated later. Do I, do I not have anything else to repair? Is there like a quick way for me to look? It's at 99% right now. The repair status. Do I hit it again? Oh, the headlight? Oh, it was the headlight. All right, cool. Looks pretty good. Oh, we're going to pump the tire. Scan the flat tire. Ceiling kit. Repair the flat tire by crafting and using a ceiling kit or replace the flat tire with a spare tire found in the locker. Dude, should I, should I learn? Hold on. Crafting and using a ceiling kit. Let's have a look. I think I can... I think I can fix the rust, but I don't think that is what fixes it. Ceiling kit... I can make it. I can make it. All right. No, I can't. I lied. I need more duct tape. How do I make duct tape? Can I make duct tape or... There's going to be some duct tape somewhere, no? No scan target. Do I get any duct tape anywhere? I might just have to... Uh, I'm just going to get the spare tire. Let's, uh, let's remove it. There we go. I, I guess I'll just drop it there. Grab the tire. All right. I think we can eventually get rid of the rust. This is like a normal door. So it's fine. Mechanics kit, loose wheel. Okay. I believe I had the mechanics kit, so... What? That took the whole kit. Really? Okay. All right. I think the car's almost ready to go. Cardboard boxes. Uh, am I putting them in here? Oh, I'm taking them with me. All right, bet. Install craft mat in the trunk. Craft mat. What is this for? Work out the back of your car with this rudimentary set of equipment. While it may not be as good as what you have in the garage, it'll work in a pinch. Okay, so it's like a crafting session for the back of our car. Have a good night, Vessel. We'll see you later, man. Oh. Thank you, thank you. Oh. There's a little prototype of mine in the garage. The arc device. Hook it up to your car, wherever it'll fit. What the hell is this? A minimap. This beauty won't just be your tour guide. It's your North Star and the only way back to safety. Heck. You should consider it the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit if you plan on staying alive. That's how important this thing will be to you. Yes, that's my very own invention. I'll tell you more about it if you live long enough to use it. Okay. Amen. Show Legends. New waypoint, arrival road, exit road. Fairway ready. Too close. I think, honestly, guys, I might, um... I might turn I might turn on a lot of the easy features, the stuff that makes the game easy. Well not easy, but at least I won't lose everything when I die. You know what I mean? Protect player when car doors are closed, uh 
Ambient damage. Restore the car after a success. I might do this. Because I feel like repairing the car every single time. And I kind of want to have fun. I kind of want to have fun when we... Like, all of this is fine. Infinite, like, uh, I'll leave all that on. You hate fun? Oh, okay. Like, a failed run penalty? Lose most items. Instability storm and gateway. I mean, that, that's probably all fine. I think I'll leave... Wait, what is this? No, that's... What did I change? I'm just going to restore the car every time we get back, maybe. Oh, no, we'll see. We'll, we'll leave it as is. And if, if it's like a hassle restoring the car every single time, we won't bother. Um, okay, let me grab a first aid kit. Is this looking at the inventory of... Can I do that? What's in my hands right now? So first aid station, and this is another first aid station. Why does it just close? Do I have to have my hands out? Am I trolling right now? I mean, there's, if I press tab, Hands pack. Fifty health. Is this like dude, there's a chance my my F to interact is bugging the game right now. I'm gonna go to the toilet real quick. I'll be right back. Alright, I just went to the toilet real quick, but I just figured out where I went wrong. The first aid kit is in the locker. Right, they just put someone. Someone put them in the locker. I was I was going to the uh, the first aid locker the entire time. Uh, store items for your drive in the trunk. All right. Oh, I just took damage somehow. Oh, beautiful. Okay, I can get rid of this stuff that I have. So we'll just drag most of that in. Um, flares. Does it want me to store everything? Scrapper, first aid kit, fuel can. All right, let's put the fuel. The scrapper and the first aid. Beautiful. I've noticed I don't have a trunk. Blueprint gear. Pick up the impact hammer blueprint by the front. Impact hammer, okay. Alright, there's a few... Scrap metal gas cylinder gear. Not every natural resource can be carefully extracted. Sometimes you need pneumatically assisted brute force. This captive bolt device is an ideal is ideal for fracturing crystals, dislodging de deposits, or just smashing. Mm, okay. Um. Oh, I had free fuel here, and I was freaking siphoning right next to me. Do -do -do. Okay. What's this now? Charge station. If you're all set, take a look at the projector against the wall. This Grab is zone. What did I just charge? These borders, all matter has lost the ability to hold a constant physical state. What that means is the shape, size, and makeup of just about everything constantly changes. A mile of grass can turn into 10 miles of swamp in the blink of an eye, and it does, constantly. It's caused by something we call instability. We're completely surrounded by it, and once you've watched it chew through entire mountain ranges, you'll understand that you don't want to get anywhere near it. We can only survive in here within pockets of stability. That's what you're standing in now, and that's what you're seeing mapped on the route planner. If 
if we're going to find you a way out of the zone, you'll need to build a new antenna. Until then, you won't be able to detect stabilized routes beyond your immediate area. So, you've got to go hunting for parts, and that means taking a drive. Go on, pick a route. The Octavice in your car will then show you where you need to go. Okay, so... We just drive straight ahead. This seems to be only one route. Um... There's like a, a legend on the side here that's telling me like what is on the route. Uh, it, it says like there's, I guess that the one that says none is like shit to mine. Then the house is like houses we're going to pass by. Junction conditions. I don't know what, what that is. Okay. Three hours? Make a left out of the garage and follow the access road. After making contact with Oppie Planet. Three hours? Okay, it's not actually going to take three hours though, right? Wait, that'd be kind of cool if I was actually stuck here for three hours. All right, uh, let's close the door. And we go. What did the charge station charge, though? I'm, I'm kind of confused. Will it tell me here? Does it tell me anywhere in the logbook? Well, it should be fine. I charged something. I feel like I should have been holding my, my like, crafting thing. Okay, there's a whole lot more going on now. Um, oh, you hold uh, tab whenever you want to open something and it's like telling you how to play. Like car dashboard. Your vehicle status can be tracked by watching the ga the gogs on the dashboard as well as the lights and other devices installed around the cab. The center console displays the health and status of each car component. The radiation monitor lets you know how safe it is to get out of your car. And if it's anything but a flat line, exit with caution. Okay. In the passenger seat, there's a screen with a map. You can see your location and key points of interest. As you drive, keep an eye on the car's structural integrity, its fuel and battery levels. Oh, I charge, oh, real, I charge the car battery, true, true, true. And the various warning lights. An orange light signals developing problems. Red light calls for immediate action. Okay, so brake, parking, LAM, low battery. Gog is gog, you know how it is. Okay, just, that was trolling. That was trolling, we do a little trolling. Um, alright, cool. I was talking to earlier, Shadow, how I heard someone, uh, pronounce subsequently, subsequently. I was like, what the f- there's no way. Oh, I gotta turn the car on, my bad. Very cool, okay, any car people? Look at me turn my lights on. Ah! All right, so we're going this way. I have a waypoint, so I don't even have to follow the map. That's kind of... That's kind of badass. Oh, I'm, I'm fucking touching the map while I'm driving. Dude, low-key, the car feels so much better than, um, than the last car we had. Our real car. Sorry, my screen just went black for a little bit. Um, yeah, so we're going here. Did I just fast travel? Oh, I did just fast travel. Perpetual stability. Okay, newbie. I'll keep this simple. Don't want to overwhelm that little brain of yours. You'll need a few things to rebuild the antenna at the garage. First on the list is plasma. The woods are littered with plasma generators. Look for a research trailer or a spark tower. That's those antenna things zapping you when you get too close. Both are always accompanied by plasma generators. Okay. The Arc device is picking up on some plasma generators nearby. Your headset has a built-in scanner. Use it on the plasma generator and it'll figure out the tools you need. All right, guys, I don't know where the hell I'm going. I don't know what the hell's going on. I'm gonna get out of here. Find and scan a plasma generator. Plasma generator. Ah, looks like it's ripe for the picking. 
Due to my reading all the law, private field notes, Dr. A.F. Kingi, day unknown. As we continue to explore viable energy solutions in the increasingly unstable environment, that is the zone, we've begun testing the first handheld plasma containment devices. In a zone plagued with radiation instability, electromagnetic interference, and many as yet explained phenomena, any infrastructure created for energy transmission has proven to be all but useless. Hence our investigations into the potential of charged and even magnetized plasma, studying both the conductive and capa capacitive qualities of the samples we have contained. Plasma would likely be far more efficient than the diesel and gasoline we've been forced to haul from place to place. If the latest research from the LIM tech team is to be believed, we may soon have a way to make it just as portable. So they're using plasma for energy, except uh, aside from, sorry, to replace gas and stuff. Would that have like, would all this stuff have caused like what's been happening at the, the zone? Is this like before the zone or after the zone occurred? No, no, it's after because they're investigating the unstable environment. At present, we await updates from Dr. Essid as she finalizes her report on Birkland currents. Ada management are keen for us to test this technology in the field as soon as possible, but we don't believe it is ready yet. They are as ever simply trying to rush research and save money okay so can't get at it with your hands though an impact hammer will do the trick that's not good oh okay so we have to make a, an impact hammer now uh blueprints i saw that here so let's pin that to checklist oh okay you can pin like one one or two and then the checklist is on my left there Find those materials by any means necessary no one's coming back ever again so go on and take what you need Transports, homes, outposts, facilities, they've all been abandoned since the zone was decommissioned in 87. Most of those structures won't even be there the next time the instability scrambles the area. So loot to your heart's content. Just loot away. So we always come back to the area, which is like getting reset by the place. So is that how the gameplay works? Like the instability, the, the zone itself is what rearranges this place in the lore? Um, also, like, who are these people talking to me? Like, what? Oh, how? Oh, I got clothes. Oh, no. Fabric. Locker. Plastic. More fabric. Okay, we got a bunch of fabric, at least. Uh, we're missing two gears. Two gears. Where am I going to find that? I mean, we looted that already. Toolbox. I've already looted that. Look at you! Out in the zone, all on your own. They grow so fast, don't they? And I'll be back at the helm. Been a long time, old gal. Didn't think we'd uh, talk again after that whole Sasquatch incident. Yes, I was hoping to go another decade without hearing your voice again. What did you finally talk Francis to death? Hello to you too, Oppie. And no, I'm still here. Uh, did these did these mama suckers get stuck in the radio? Lab computer. Telephone transcript. Central exchange monitoring July 9th, 1963. Hello, hello. Is that the officer? Is that the office of Dr. Turner? No, no. The other Dr. Turner. Doesn't matter. I have good news. The best news. Your new computers are up and running. We did it. And these powerhouses are going to absolutely blow you away. We've got some of the world's very best discrete RTL-based integrated circuits with a central processing unit running at one of the one and a half megahertz. That's like nothing, no? Back then it would have been a lot. All of this able to address half a million characters of memory. We've even got we've even got a 32-bit word length. It's hard to imagine a more powerful machine. What's more, these things barely weigh 70 pounds. That's so funny. Oh my god. It's truly amazing. You absolutely must come down to see one in action. I think RD, ARDA, RDA, ARDA, might as well have pushed computing as far as it will ever go. That's pretty funny. Oh, okay. Then the hazmat cabinet, partial memo, source unknown, circa 1966. When was the plasma generator spoken of? Hmm. I know it's inconvenient to lock everything away, and I know it requires issuing all of our staff, not just keys, but the right set of keys and then collecting and reissuing those keys as staff are rotated and reassigned. But please also consider the sheer volume of materials and resources that have gone missing these last few months. We've had a rare substance and corrosive chemicals spirited away. What the fuck? 
Compounds and catalysts vanish into thin air. Even a whole cabinet whisked out of an office and dragged away by one of those, you know. Other things that like chase me in this game. And since these materials are so expensive, so vital and sometimes, you know, state secrets, I'd rather we started locking things up. Got that. Interesting. Can you get a qu quick re recap? Basically, okay, so basically like, I think I'm going to read all of it. I I'm actually going to understand the story for this game for the first time I've ever played a single game. But right now, we have like radio, like voices in a radio talking to us. And I think they're like ex-scientists or people that used to work in the zone. Um, and then pretty much what we've learned so far in this area is that they were using plasma as an energy source because it was like easier to use than gasoline and fuel to bring into the zone while they were like studying the zone. I can't break that open. Um, so I think we're going to start using plasma. I don't know if the plasma like was a cause for everything kind of like going downhill but we are going to see here but we honestly haven't done much because i was just repairing the car a bunch um okay we're gonna put this in our bag i mean i guess i could logbook everything but we'll see what they tell us in a sec but i'm currently looking for materials to make a tool Logbook, let's see this. Supply container. Private field notes. Dr. Everett, date unknown. Our time is up. It seems... Sorry, our time is up, it seems. And as much as we might try, we cannot abandon the zone fast enough. We are leaving so much behind. Each day we are instructed to close another lab and junk everything there. Or to mark, uh, or to mark it for what they call recycling. But we know no such recycling will happen. We may as well loot our own equipment. We dash out the door, leaving things on the table, our experiments half finished or logs incomplete. We're creating a ghost town in our wake, even a whole series of ghost towns, a ghost nation, if you will, our own Mary Celeste, a record of all our last moments, frozen in time. So I think that, yeah, it's like stuff goes disappearing in the zone and the zone was increasing in size as well. Um, like a, like a, when we, when the game kind of started, they, they were telling us that the zone has been increasing in size over the last few years. So it is kind of Chernobyl-esque. I oh, recommended tool hands. Let me use my hands. Anything there? Just more supply. Okay. But yeah, I think stuff was going missing. So they were saying that how they locked stuff away into lockers because they noticed things were going missing, like state secrets and like that they were really important stuff. So they couldn't afford for things to go missing. A backpack. It's very dark in here. So I don't know if they thought at the time people were stealing stuff, but I think it's pretty apparent stuff was just disappearing. Okay, so in the back of my car here, I can craft. We're going to craft a impact hammer. Gear. Wait, I didn't find gears. Hold on. Where the heck, where the heck are gears? Oh, scrap metal can be turned into gears. Okay. Oh, and just from this page as well, I can craft the stuff that I'm able to craft. Like if there's a, a, a piece of material I have to craft, I can craft it in the menu of the tool I want to craft. It's pretty handy. Okay, this is the impact hammer. Smash plasma generators for materials. Also, we didn't give a fuck about the plasma generator. Hey, uh, uh, driver. I bet you're dying to hear all about the remnants by now. Oh, can you not? I'm a little busy trying to keep them alive. I'll keep to the basics, I promise. They deserve to know what they're getting into. Fine. I'm giving you 60 seconds. That is not nearly enough time to get... 55 seconds and counting. Okay, okay, okay. The remnants, in short, they're old objects that do all sorts of weird things. They, they bind themselves to people, and, and you're the latest victim. You and the car are inseparable now, so, so get acquainted. Once the remnant is bound to someone, they become gradually more obsessed with it. It takes over the victim's mind until they go crazy and run off into the zone with it. Oh, it's like no a ring in Lord of the Rings. To resist its siren call. That fixation is probably worming its way into your brain as we speak. This is the first time we've ever got our hands on one. Uh, 
but we know all about the past remnants, and oh gosh, this one time it materialized as an old copper kettle, and the tea that came out of that thing, it was... And now I'm splitting the transmissions going to your receiver. Anything critical to your immediate needs will broadcast directly and immediately to your radio and headset. Anything not mission critical will be on a low priority frequency. Those transmissions will be recorded and indexed for you to listen to at your leisure. And by low priority, I mean just about everything that comes out of Tobias's mouth. <laughs> Alright, fair. Yo, what's up, Bacon? Yeah, it's pretty good. I like the crafting so far. Um, let me know if the voices are too loud compared to everything else, because I still can't tell, but, you know. Uh, let's have a look at the thing here. A small, tightly sealed cylinder containing an extremely conductive material composed mostly of highly charged particles. Do not open this. Noted. So I think resources are like the law. Anomalies? I mean, we haven't discovered anything. Conditions? That's just like... I think like if you get hit oh no actually no that's not even that instability will not be chasing you here unless summoned wait what transmissions oh i can go back and uh oh i can go back and see all of the dialogue we've had in the game as well that's pretty good an old copper kettle and the tea that came out of that thing. Do you reckon... Wait, hold on. This is the first time we've ever got our hands on one. But we know all about the past remnants. And oh gosh, this one time it materialized as an old copper kettle. And the tea that came out of that thing. Okay, am I trolling? But could Tobias have been someone that had a remnant as well? And he was obsessed with the, the kettle? Because he liked the tea? Or is he just trolling? I, did I miss any part of the story where that's like a really bad guess? You have to guess... Okay, you have to guess the information from? Alright. Is that like a decent assumption or am I dumb? Okay, we got glass shards, plasma. I didn't even check back here. Hold on. Radio. Consumer electronics. What made me choose this game? A lot of people recommended it to me. M's, Trippy... Uh, and it looks cool. It, it looks really, really cool. If you have one, you will eventually go insane. So you can't. Okay, so like, there's no way to escape it. Interesting. How do they get in the radio? I mean, I guess we'll figure it out, right? True. Uh, journal fragment date unknown. Everyone's checked out of town. At this point, I'm the last person. I'll be gone by tomorrow too. It's hard to believe this was once a community. Sure, we didn't have that much to show for it. Not much to offer. Oh, sorry. Not much to offer visitors. No great signs or, or no great sites or famous landmarks. But a few of us lived out here and we were happy with our lot. And then it seems the government had other plans for us. You no longer live here, they said. Here's your compensation payment. Now get out. Their weird secret experimentation zone keeps growing. They own this land now, this town, and soon we'll never be able to come back. They barely gave us enough to cover the costs of moving. Now it's time. That's crazy. That's crazy that that, that can just happen. Okay, we got a bunch of shirts. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I think this will just register as like regular storage in the yeah, supply container. I need like a flashlight, man. Can I hit this thing? Ooh, okay. Hey, where's my flashlight though? Let's be honest. I'm just taking everything. I'm taking everything. A TV? Recommended tool scrapper? Oh. Hit two to loot all mass transfer vehicles into the trunk. Wait, what did I just do? Oh. <laughs> did I just move the car, but like, not that long? Oh, when I'm looting a chest hit T? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> let me, uh... Oh, ours put that back? Okay, hold on, let me hold. Let me put the, the uh, this shit here, hold on. 
Okay. Let me grab my scrapper. Okay, I'm gonna scrap everything. I'm also... Holy crap, I can imagine you spend, like, a lot of time in this, uh... In these areas here. Am I even scrapping shit right now? Oh, yeah. thank you. Point, thank you for the prime, bro. Creature pretending to be happy while suffering in agonizing pain. That's probably a waste doing it there, right? Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, guys, be sure to coin some love. Thank you, the, thank you for the resub. The, the shady emote. Oh, it broke? Oh, true? Can I craft that again? I can. Okay, lucky the scrapper is easy to craft. Let me try this, uh... And I'm looting a chest. Let's see. So if I, like... Can I scrap this? No. So I can... Or did I do this wrong? Because it's technically not a chest. Far from destination. Right, I'll figure it out. I think I need to actually be looting something. I assume as well they'll teach me how to do it. Yeah, that's not a chest, right? Yeah, yeah, I agree. My bad, my bad. Oh, I can't grab that. All right. Um, what is... Oh, that's a throw? I can throw stuff. All right. Oh, it does? Okay, okay. All right, well, I'll figure that out. So I should just move everything into the car. I'd imagine, like, the stuff that I'm crafting with... Oh, do I need to eat? No, that's just for health. I'd imagine a lot of the stuff that I'm crafting with will be, like, automatically added here. Right, okay, so if I did... I see. Okay, and the steel. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Beautiful. All right, thank you for that. Well, um... Let's go find another plasma generator. Before I do that as well, let's just double check. The hard drive isn't about to just run out of storage. Now we're fine. Wait, what does that say? Last save 10 minutes ago? Okay. Ooh. Wait, I was in park that... I was in drive that whole time. That's, I heard like some of the bad reviews from this game where people not really understanding what to do. I feel like a lot of games are like that though. Also, oh, I'm gonna make sure I look really, whoa, 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 what the fuck? Whoa, what is that? Hello? What the heck is this thing? Yo! Yo, why was my shit getting plunged just then? I gotta remember to look really far this way because I don't want my cam. Don't drive into light! Okay, bet! What is this? Alright, I just drove into those rocks. Will they just take my car? No way, right? I'll see. Oh, I'm probably wasting car battery here. Oh, this one's already been broken. Oh, I gotta be able to make a flashlight. Wait. I mean, I've got flares. But there would have to be a flashlight somewhere here. Nope. Damn, okay, I gotta be really careful then. Alright. What else have we got around here? A 
flare gun. Alright, uh... Oh, I dropped the flare when I switched weapon. Pressurized cartridges. I will grab. Whoa, transmuter? What the heck is that? Transmuter. Private field notes, Dr. A.F. Kingi. Eight un date unknown. Please find attached the installation plan for these newer compact LIM converters, along with my resignation from ARDA, effective immediately. It has become the favored it has become the favored pastime of my peers to gripe about the youth of today, but I find myself sentimental. Maybe the next generation will be the ones to right our wrongs. Their bright-eyed, bushy-tailed optimism reminds me of the early days when we thought what's that music? Thought limb technology uh, we thought limb technology's potential limitless. This machine is a step forward that original vision where limb bridges the gap between our uh, the materials given to us and our imaginations okay so this was like something he's very proud of what the fuck do i do gear to chemicals so it can it can change what happens if i do this can it be stored here can I put in there? Oh, hello. Oh, it's empty. Turn all my scrap into gears. Right, so it's actual, like, gear in the literal, uh, the, like, the literal word. Let me have a look. Uh, that was a very lazy way to make gears just then. Oh, did that go into my inventory as well? Hold on. I've got two gears. Okay. Why did you shoot the gears back? Oh, do I have to do f all of them? No, right? Oh, it's random per transmuter. Do I potentially need more gears? Real though, the game doesn't really teach you anything. I'm just free balling. Let's try four. Oh, right. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I, I, I don't know what chemicals do. I just wanted to do a bit of conversion, but... I think I found a few chemicals lately. Maybe maybe in some areas they're a lot easier to find than in other areas they're not as easy. Is art? That's to remove it, yeah? Okay, I should not remove that. What's up, Flame? It kind of is, but I don't think it's... I don't think there's anything else out here with me. I think... Like, there are these robots out here. But I don't think it plays as as much like the forest where like, you know, you're running away from things. Well, I, I actually don't know. It's a very mysterious game so far. But right now I'm trying to visit all these destinations. Oh my God, wait, chill. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get any three-legged women in this game. So I'm currently walking around to each of these, like, stations on my map. Okay, so this one's smashed. Did I keep my flares on me? I didn't. Okay. That's right. We can do this without. Looking, it's fine. 
Do some quick looting. Oh. Oh, my pry bar's done. That's right, I'll have to make a new one. What's been happening, Flame? How have you been? Uh, what is this? Anomaly encounters. Can I... Oh, I just threw them. Lol. <laughs> I just threw them. Okay, so there's six anomaly encounters in total. Someone say pegging? Did we? Whoa. Oh, Baron! Thank you for the three years, man. You. Three years, B-L-U-E-B-A-L-L-E-R-S. Thank you, uh, thank you, Baron. Guys, push your bone some love. Thank you for the, the prime, bro. I really appreciate that. Three years, that's fucking crazy. How are you doing today, man? Okay, I normally encounter one. So I was in the deep, I was in the deep zone, taking notes. I screwed up a page and I threw it aside. That's when it first appeared. Something I couldn't see, but I swear was there. Ate the paper and I dropped. The, the, ate the paper, I dropped. Later, I would hear it rummaging in the dumpsters. It's all those old journals we tossed as part of the move. Those drew it out. It would eat cardboard too. I heard you could get it to follow you by dropping scraps as you walked. You'd never see a thing. It was like a ghost, but you'd sure hear it. So it was like a ghost that would eat paper? <laughs> a ghost that eats paper? Kind of crazy. Okay, can I... I can't leave for some reason. Wait, here we go. A paper-eating ghost. I'll hold on to it for now. All right, that's extremely dark here, so let's try to get out. As soon as we can. Yep, I can't see anything. So these are the plasma generators. We need to find two, uh, four more. What? There must be like a big one somewhere here. Let me uh, press T. Very nice. Good tip. Good tip. We started college two weeks ago and it's been super busy. Dude. How, uh, what's your schedule like? It's been three years for you. You just haven't been subbed the whole time. And you've had like 10 different names as well. Hmm. How much gas do I have? Oh, we're pretty good. What is this thing? I don't know what this, this thing is. Dude, there's a big X on this. Oh, oh, sorry. Full closet, okay. Yeah, that's pretty full on. I might leave the car here. Am I using like a shit ton of fuel trying to go up here? I think so, I think like... What is this? Abilities equipped? Oh, you get car abilities. Interesting. Whoa, I'm going backwards now! Oh shit! All right, that's fine. I'll be back. It's in here, fuel back. Oh, let's siphon this shit. Wait, do I even have my fuel thing on me? Should go grab it. I, I should make a crowbar as well. It's a ship, maybe. I don't know, like there's apparently like more complicated driving controls. Oh, I used all my scrap. I used all my scrap, although I could make a, a scrapper. Do I have a scrapper? I have a scrapper right now. Let's see. Cause a piece of shit, I'm better off. You know what? You might be right. The side, yeah, the side drifts are sick though. But yeah, it's, I think it's kind of like the long drive or I'd, I'd imagine it's like that. But a central focus on my car being like... Something I love and cherish. And we're also trying to investigate what went wrong around here. I don't know, maybe a soccer mom got sucked into the zone. And then that's how this car arrived here. Give it the boot anomalies bothering me. Oh, damn, that fucking trash just went flying. The car is the main character, yeah. And apparently, like... I, my character will become obsessed with the car. 
and I'll start to go crazy. So the car's like an anomaly. Kind of interesting. I'm curious to see how it'll end. What is that sound? Oh, there's a plasma generator there. I might, uh... Hold on. Can I lose the car, by the way? Okay, I think we'll do this stuff down here. There's a big, like, warehouse up here. I think. It looks like a warehouse on the map. It's, uh, striked as an X. Uh, I need to make a pry bar. Okay, actually, I can probably do everything I need to do up here without the car. I was just worried without a pry bar. It would not have been possible. Or I might, like, encounter a door. What the fuck is this? Hello? Stable anchor? That looks bad if I if I pull that out. Anchor plug. Private field notes, Dr. Mensa, March 3, 1970. We have now completed the process of standardizing and replacing all of the anchor mounts and infrastructure. These new mounts should be far more durable, steadfast against weather and atmospheric changes and resistant to any corrosion. These have been, this has been a lengthy and difficult process marred by endless delays. It is my hope that most of these mounts will hold for at least 50 years. What year is it right now that I'm here? But many projections suggest two or even 300. That's far longer than, uh, that's far longer than many anchors themselves. This was, I believe, worth it. As usual, I will be compiling and submitting a full casualty list by 1,000 hours tomorrow morning. At that time, I would begin to notify next of kin. So, motherfuckers died? Yeah, it's kind of like a... It's, it's a sci-fi story. Um, it's giving, like, very big, like, Chernobyl zones. Uh, Ch Chernobyl vibes where there's, like, um, uh, uh, like a contamination zone. Uh, what is, an exclusion zone. And it slowly grows. And, like, a, like just weird stuff happens inside. So, we're trying to escape. We got sucked in while uh, Amazon delivery driving. Dumpster pearl. Slice a pearl in half and you'll find thousands of layers of precious materials forming around the core. Break one of these apart, who knows what'll pop out. Can I, um... No, I think I actually gotta move this around. Hang on. Um, this is a quick way to sort it. Roadside pearl. Interesting, okay. That's what someone was telling... Uh, no, that's what I saw a Steam review was. Uh, people were saying this game is store car. I've never played Stalker, though. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god, I thought its head turned. Tourist. Dictaphone recording office of Dr. Richard Preble, circa 1976. Getting sucked into a Chernobyl zone is probably better conditions than a normal Amazon work. That's true, actually. That's actually very true. Hi, Christina. Hi. Hey, hi. Hi. How are you? So, um, it turns out you were right. We've had reports from several regions of the zone now, and they're very similar. We have we have these dummy things out in the wilderness now, and um, we also have them inside abandoned houses. We also have them in gas stations, on the road, on top of signs. One report here says on a roof. We've spotted about 600 now. The file catalogs each and every one. Oh, and you're quite right about the other thing too. Yeah. I know what happens when someone touches one. We all got plenty of data on that. So, um, I'm gonna be applying for a position in Portland now. I've done my review. It was great. It was a great time being contracted here for sure, but I'm not sure I want to work at Arda full time, you know? It's very strange here. You work in a very strange place. I'm sure you're doing very important work and I respect that greatly, but I think I'd like to go back to academia now. Oh god, there's one of them outside. I know for a fact it wasn't there before. Do you reckon this dude got got? Should I touch it? Um. Ah! Okay? It just explodes.
A bit scary. Oh, what was that? Oh, light blue paint. I can paint my car. I'm going to eat that food, actually. Can I eat it from here? Use. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck is going on here? It's the rocks. All right. Okay, that food didn't heal me at all. Some spicier. Yeah. Hey, I'm grabbing this. Um, let me read some lore before anything happens. Pothole. Answer phone message transcript. Origin unknown. February 12th, 1966. Hey, boss. So I'm out here working with Mira and Tobias from maintenance. And I'm afraid I've got some bad news about our gear. We've run into some trouble and I don't think we're getting it, we're getting it back anytime soon. Sorry, bad start for my first potholing job. Call me when you get this. Or better still, I think you should just come down here and see for yourself. Our tools, our signs, our lights, they've all taken flight, so to speak. Really, I'm serious. I'm dead serious, you should see this. You know how you told me we were normal people working in a very abnormal place? I think I know what you mean now. Interesting. Okay. I have 2.5k radiation. What does that mean? I'm gonna go put this in the car. Wait, can I even fit it in the car? I I put it here. Okay, I grabbed it too early. What the hell? What did I just do? Huh. Some Iron Man shit. Oh, I gotta put stuff in my in my boot. What what is going on there? All right, we'll continue on. Do you not click the po the pulsing diamonds on the map? Okay. Whoa! What the fuck was that? This is, my, this is the road to get a HSB. Yeah, real. All right, I might have to siphon some gas here in a sec. Is the atmosphere and like the sound of the game loud enough, guys? Holy shit. Can you guys see what I'm hearing right now? This was IRL and you get infinite door dash credit. <laughs> I'd do it. I'd do it for infinite door dash credit. What the fuck? Bollard. Transmission fragment, origin unknown, March 21st, 1960. Oh, this is an earlier one. Yes, Anita, I do agree with you that this unknown short... Uh, I, I do agree with you that this is nothing short of remarkable. And yes, I also think that we're seeing what we're seeing here is something new and unique. Something unmatched by anything the zone has previously offered up. What, this little piece of ground sticking up? This is early in the zone, though, so maybe it is is—it is like super unique for that time. But I must disagree with your conclusions. Strongly, I strongly disagree. These abrupt, dangerous, grotesque things are one of a host of bizarre new geological phenomena. They very likely occur in response to the ground vibration or local disturbances. And I think that that's the end of it. Oh, fuck. So he was like, it's nothing that bad. So yeah, this must have been like an early thing. 
It's nothing that bad. And then uh, all this shit is happening. To suggest that they are deliberate reaction, even a defense mechanism takes our discussion in a very different and quite uncomfortable direction. I think we should be reviewing your reports before you submit them. This conversation goes no further and I'll be scrubbing the transmission logs as soon as possible, understand? So the, the, well, it was like a, a cover up. What is this? Oh, it's just a thing. Oh, we got plasma. Okay, we are, sorry, our goal right now is to destroy these things. Okay, we get plasma. Get our materials. Oh, it's 1998, true. I forgot, it was my birthday. Just in time to abuse the 30 or le 30 minute or less domino, dude. They had that for a while. I think I think when like in 2010 they had that no as well. Or am I just remembering? Okay, keep looting, keep looting. I really do need some kind of flashlight for these areas. I will say. I can't look at that. Not necessarily. I I think kind of more of a danger than. A danger right now to me is really the environment. Sorry, it's so dark here. I gotta make more flares. The environment is, is more of a danger than anything. Also, these things keep appearing. I'm gonna throw this at it. It didn't do shit. So these are, these are called tourists. Yeah, I just hit two to loot all. Bat, bat, bat. I always end up just like manually pressing shit. Keep scrapping the cars. And I think it's done in like the form of missions. So we've been like sent on a mission right now. And our mission is to, yeah. Um, it's the stuff at the top right, but it's to... Well, actually, we, we do want replacement parts for the entire car. Interesting. Yo, Crude! Thank you for the raid, man. Appreciate it. How was Forza 2? Long time no see. Hello, hello, guys. Give uh, Crude a follow. Mm, I could side from the field, but... Oh, you got a wheel, dude! I'm basically playing a racing game right now, true. I, um... Oh, infantry fool. I was saying that... Well, no. It was mentioned in the chat that this game would be cool with a wheel, but I don't think you can uh, You can play... Oh, did I just transfer the wrong way? I did. Um, I don't think you can play this game on a wheel, but it'd be really cool. That's cool, though. I, I hope uh, the wheel continues to be a lot of fun. Harvesting cars. Yeah, literally, no... no. Uh, it's not Minecraft. It's like automotive Minecraft. Okay, we got some paint. Oh, I gotta press T. Sorry, I gotta press T. Actually, let me make a flare, man. Yeah, I think you have to, like, get an emulator or something to, to work it on a wheel. I think it'd definitely be worth it, though. Is this all? So, okay, I haven't learned how to make flares. I don't think I've learned how to make flares, so I think we're gonna have to... Unless, do you know what would be cool? That plasma shit I picked up. Hold on. Where is the plasma? Can I hold that and will this... No, okay. I was gonna say, if holding this like illuminates the area... That'd be, that'd have been pretty cool. Yo, what's up, Midge? Hello. It's pretty cool so far, it's... What the fuck was that? It's pretty, um... It throws you in and doesn't tell you anything. So you have to be kind of like prepared to... To learn. Oh wait, what am I doing? Is this not- Oh, it's scrap of the trap, my bad. There's- It's- It's also like kind of a lot of reading to understand the story, I think. Oh, I'm getting radiation right now. We just started, but it's almost like you're going into like... The Chernobyl like, uh, exclusion zone, except... Obviously it's not like... Typical radiation, it's more like, uh... 
abnormalities and uh, what are the anomalies and stuff happening like weird shit going on and i think the more you play the weirder it gets god i'm gonna heal what have you been up to today Mitch? it's pretty cool and you get to look after your car which i think is kind of fun i'm not really a car person but yeah oh shit Okay, I gotta look out for this thing. This thing is definitely something that will attack me. Well, it doesn't attack me, but it, like, takes my car away. So I have to... I have to drive past. And then pop my car next to it. Oh, we got two things here. Did that see me? Oh, we're good. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck? Wait, what? Hello? Hi? What is this? Okay, my car didn't like that. Is that... Oh, I'm still in range. Oh, oh yeah, wait, what is that again, Midge? Remind me, I keep forgetting. I forget instantly every single time. I should be here for that. I should be here for that. September. So hopefully I don't get a TwitchCon before. Is this gonna kill me? Like a detour? Dude, I'm down to play uh, Dark and Darker. Just let me know. I mean, you're done with that, that Star Wars game, right? I'm scared this electricity is gonna hit me. Okay. Oh, it is! I want my loot though. Oh shit. Is that thing gonna grab me? Wait, let me charge my thing. Oh, I can't hold it indefinitely. Oh, that's bad. I don't think I have any heals on me. Oh, I have that. Dog food. Oh, have you started playing Outlaws? Dude, I saw uh, you like my tweet, Mitch. I beat fucking Ogdo Bogdo yesterday. It was the worst fucking fight I've ever done in my life. And his father. Well, it looks like you're near one of the old gorilla radio stations. That ought to be prime pickings for antenna parts. Okay. Is she going to say more? Wait, if I back up. It's a yep. location to your map. Look for an antenna tower uh, up on a hill somewhere. <laughs> okay. It was such a bad... It's the worst fight in any game, I think. It was so bad. It took me like four hours. I went back in the VOD and I saw it was actually four, four and a half hours instead of three hours that I, I tweeted. Have a good night, Aiden. We'll see you later. I don't know if I, Maybe I edit these VODs and cut out... Actually, is there anything to cut out? Maybe cut out the looting? I mean, I, I, all this dialogue is kind of important, I guess. Uh, Everett said bye to Aiden. Have a good one. Dr. Everett, day unknown. Plasma-powered spark transmitters combining previously obsolete coils with LIM enhanced repeaters have proven to be the best way to boost signals throughout the zone. The constant increases in radiation and electromagnetic interferences have made has made radio communication extremely difficult and often subject to bizarre, bizarre distortions. These new modified coils appear to have solved that. Okay, cool. So they can communicate. The addition of local plasma power sources is a reliable way to keep each node within this vital infrastructure, both operational and independent. I reckon their use of plasma is, is like accelerated the issue or something. However, the price we have to pay is constant maintenance and repair. They're demanding beasts and burn through components rapidly. If key resistors and capacitors are not re regularly replaced, they quickly develop a habit of either shorting or eventually or even releasing constant high voltage, low current discharges into the immediate vicinity. Okay, so that's basically what was happening to us just then. Yeah, like where you can't read. Oh my god, no, dude, it was the worst. That was probably the the like most down. What's the down? Please, wait, the please emote. It's our please emote, but it's uh please. I think capital P. What is the emote? No, we have two. Wait, 
This one. That was me. That was me yesterday. I I couldn't believe it, man. And so, some motherfucker came in chat like, bro, you gonna cry? Fuck. I was like, all right, I'll cry. Fuck it. Uh, I didn't though. Um, locate the radio station. All right, let's have a look. I am. I'm enjoying the game. It's pretty good. I'm reading all the lore for once. Wow. Why am I going backwards? Why the fuck am I going backwards? I almost just got my ass eaten. Holy moly. Oh, not the German racist. It was some other guy. Honestly, that German racist, he motivated me to like be a better person. So I actually went on and defeated the boss, realizing I'm not that racist loser. So that was pretty good. I'm going to hit this again, dude. This is my problem with these games. I want to loot everything. Although I'm going to take damage. Wait, introductions? Oh, shit. My, my. Where are our manners? Uh, driver. We never introduced ourselves. True, thank Not you. Really. Tobias Barlow, former Artem maintenance manager. Oh, and um, here with me is Dr. Francis Cook. I was a R&D scientist researching limb technology right here in the zone. We live right in the mid zone. Just, just a hop, skip, and a jump over another big old wall from where you're at. Oh, and, and that old bat over there? That's Dr. Ophelia Turner, former director of research and development herself. The mother of limb technology. The maven of electromagnetism. That's enough. Resident party pooper. <laughs> okay. Hold on. I missed a tiny bit of that, um, that interaction there. Where was it? The zone? Introductions. So we live right in the mid zone. Just a hop skip. So they're real people. Like they're actually alive. I was an R&D scientist researching limb. Okay. They're in the mid zone. So I assume the further through the game we get, we'll find them. Didn't know what a mojito was and he left her on red? He didn't know what a mojito? Wait, maybe you can show the gang what a mojito is. Locate the radio station. I'm going to assume that is the radio station down there. How do I turn the radio on, by the way? No radio music? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Oh, what? I can turn the volume up as well. Ah, what the heck? I should have been doing that from the start. That's cool. Very nice. Oh, vehicle protection compromise. Wait, what? Hello? Kind of good, right? Okay, this is where I had to go. I should repair the car. This... <laughs> the way I'm driving right now. Is it on or off? Oh. Oh, yeah. Turning it off is instant. I forgot. Dude, my, my car's a button. My bad. Do some by Lando, bro. By Lando in this would go freaking good. By Lando. I need to turn it off though. It uses battery. Okay, I need to repair. I have some of the repairing paste. Um, let me. Oh, did I just drop that? I'm trolling. I think I just dropped that. Oh, no, I'm holding it. Okay, cool. So I think it would be the front that was like fucked up, no? Headlight. Oh, I'm out. Wait. Craft mat. Repair putty. Oh, I can make heaps. I think like every car is like a button press, no? Like nowadays. I think like uh, pretty much most cars are uh, a buttons. Unless like all just every car I've been in in recent years have been buttons.
What's up, love? How are you? Okay, so we're just making sure that's all good. Let's see the status here. Oh, not like every car, obviously. Not every single car. Okay, I think I actually have to like properly repair the car because like this is very bad right now. Can I close the door? Oh, nope. Um... Oh, F, holding F is closed. I see, I see. An emergency call out? Dude, the wind was crazy. Oh, they come in two different models? I think, honestly... I wouldn't mind having, like, a regular key. Time to get moving. The instability's ticking up by the second. But you can't get back the way you came. The instability makes all routes one way. And that's where my Octavice comes into play. It'll get you back to the garage, but it needs to be charged first. Uh, but don't you worry your pretty little head about how it works. You'll be out of here soon, so there's no reason to learn more about limb technology than you need to know. Hmm. The Octavice is charged and ready. You'll use it to open a gateway back to the garage, but it will immediately collapse the stability around you. So only activate when you are absolutely ready to leave. You do not want to get caught in the storm that follows. Okay. How long is this game? Uh, Bacon, how, how long did you play the game for? Because I assume you've played it or watched someone play it. Can I climb up here? I think, it, I, I think if you don't read anything, it could be quite fast. If you don't, like, loot everything as well, it'd probably be quite fast as well. I think the game operates in, like, missions. So right now, this is like my first one. I've been sent out to find these plasma generators. And then I imagine as you do missions, you get closer and closer into the zone. Um, wait, can I grab this? Hold on. Yeah, it's, it's pretty long. So you definitely have to have, like, time set aside for it. Yeah, the game's pretty cheap right now, though. It's 40% off. I, sh I Hopefully I can finish the game. Who knows, though? Wait, oh, I didn't, uh... Hey, Yoppy, like... Look, I, I keep thinking... The way you're helping our friend here right now... Seems positively helpful. I... Seems like me... You're looking to turn a new leaf or something? The only thing I want to look at is a 12-year-old whiskey. And the back of this breacher's head when I send them packing. But isn't it worth taking a detour to run just a tiny little test? Can't think of a worse way to spend my time. Please. I've seen you manipulate waveforms with your right hand and knock back a double with your left. Or am I to understand you've <laughs> lost your touch? What I'm understanding is that you won't shut the hell up until I test this remnant. <laughs> yep. Fine, stop crowding my frequency. What? Wait, really? Harpy, darling, you never give in this easily. What's what's going on? Francis? Uh, yes? How have you not thrown him to the bunnies by now? <laughs> 80 years old and only getting sharper by the day. You're a legend. You're a role model. 80? I'm oh, my car's going faster. Wait, how do I get out? How do I get out? out of my oh, no, it's fine. Okay, okay. Uh, we're signing off. Hey, driver, good luck out there. Uh, uh, watch out for the bunnies. They are a doozy. Okay. Interesting. Dom, how are you? What's up? Until then, dude, I have to play that. Fuck, so many games, man. So many games. I don't know why I jumped on this today. I think I just saw the sound. And I was like, oh, okay. Uh, let's see what the legend was. Wait, so the big thing in the, the game really doesn't explain. The yellow circles... The anchor orbs not only uh, energy to extract, but research points for me to upgrade. Okay. I can grab the other three if I want. So I grab these and then I head to an exit, which is the link gateways. Fuck it, I'll grab them. Oops, sorry. I'm in, I'm in park. Yeah, I mean, I bought the game today and it was 26 bucks, 26 Australian dollars. It's just like a really pretty game. That's kind of what like... Got me wanting to play it. Yeet! Oh, shit, my bad. Oh, oh, okay. I think whenever that shit is going wavy, I can't get out. Like, it's a bad idea to get out of the car. Okay, I can't drive up there. 
Oh no, my bad, my bad. The car, fuck, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, I don't want to drive into these. These things explode. Dude, the game's been really fun so far. Well, like it's been fun, but interesting as well. Like a lot of crafting. Oh, uh, I kind of want to get more materials. I like the more materials I come out with, the better it is for, um, I think like my next expedition. I, I don't know what other game to compare this with because honestly, like a lot of the games, a lot of games that are like this game, I normally drop pretty quick. Like almost like the forest, but not, not, but not really. Oh, normally I don't have unlimited time. Really? Oh, it's locked. Can I? Oof. Sheesh. All right. Oh, no space for that. That's fine. I don't know if it's turn, turn brain off. I think for the start, you have to have your brain on. Like understanding the basics of like what everything does for sure. But then like right now, I can see myself starting to turn my brain off a little bit. Like I'm not too, too pressed. What is this telling me to do? Hold on, use the arc device map to locate and drive to an anchor site. Okay, yeah, we're, well, I mean, we've already got that, right? Gather and craft. Replace, I mean, should I replace my car parts now? Let me also, wait, there was a bit of dialogue I missed in the logbook. It was, um... I think it was this one, was it? No. I think I missed one at the top. Yeah, it, it is it is pretty unique so far. Um, okay, let's go to my door. So do I do I just make another door maybe? A crude door? Wait, crude door is like bad though. That's like shitter than my current door. I'm not gonna bother yet. Oh, okay. You robber, god damn. Okay, I need a lot of stuff. Okay, let's go to this one over here, though. Shit, I, I should just scrap everything. I'm gonna have to make a new scrapper, though. This one's about to go. Yeah, it's a little bit of Minecrafting. It's right there. I just made two scrappers. I'm trolling. Uh, oh, hello. Wait, don't do that. I'm fine. Uh, let's put... Where is this scrapper that I'm holding right now? Oh, I dropped it. Can I like... Wait, hold. There we go. All right. I don't have enough space in my inventory to actually... Put it in my bag. I gotta hold it. <laughs> Sub dog potentially has returned. What is the oh the the foot long foot long hot dog? Is that doing shit? There we go. I never had it. Subathon with it, and I have to eat it in one go. I could probably put a foot long in my mouth, no? Like the whole thing. Oh, a lot to craft here. You don't think so? Proof Subathon. Subathon, I guess. Hey, am I getting radi radiized right now? 
What's a footlong in centimeters? The girl, no, not a, not of the the hot dog one, right? Thirty centimeters. Fuck, no, nah, I'd have to like bend it. I'm seeing this random spicy spots. Audio socks. Offering. Journal fragment day unknown. There's nothing left now, nothing at all. The radios are dead. Every electro, uh, every electronic device has shorted or failed. The very last scraps of food are so rotten, not even a rat would scavenge them. Not that I've seen a rat in this place in years. I've never found, I haven't found anything close to a functional car within 20 square miles. Rubber perishes so rapidly, metal rusts or is irradiated or both. I'm down to my last few drops of gasoline. Sounds like he's drinking it. Not that the generator has anything to power beyond a handful of light bulbs. And if I tried to repair anything, those anomalies would pull it back apart within a day. I think the others have evacuated without me. I can't blame them. They probably think I didn't make it. Or, team, or our team leader didn't. The second army escort didn't. Even that bug watch reporter woman and her crew just... Well, their car has now been picked apart too. Bet, bet, bet. Okay. So no one makes it out of here. Um, put everything in my trunk. A lot of loot. Beautiful. Did I just drop that? I have a feeling I... I have a feeling I actually just dropped... No, no. It's still in my hands. Let me put it somewhere here. Let's rotate. All right. So... I keep forgetting to turn the car on. We're gonna go up here. Here we go. So these are like our upgrade things. Yoink. They look important. Thank you. So... Anchors are a source of enormous but extremely unpredictable energy. You can feed them to arc device, uh, the arc device in the passenger seat to extract that energy. Once the device is powered to a certain level, it will be able to open a gateway to get you back to the auto shop. The amount of anchor energy needed to open a gateway will vary by junction, but as long as you make it through the gateway, you'll recapture the energy you used to open it. Oh, okay, so you get the energy back. That energy is also used to create items and equipment at the fabrication station. Try to bring as much as you can. Okay, so you need a certain amount to leave. Those anchors may look like glowing balls of magic, but it's Limtech through and through. Don't be scared. They haven't exploded in anyone's Whoa! face. Recently. Whoa! Hold up! Wait, they're fucking my car up. Oh, I opened the back door. Whoops, can I close it from here? Hello? Oop. What? Is my car fucked? Oh, I had to hold it for longer. Whoops, whoops, whoops. That scared me. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. I should really use the re review mirror. How do you break in this? She. Oh, oh, oh. Don't worry about me. Take your time. If you never get back to the garage, that suits me just fine. Okay, bitch. Dude. I'm so sorry. I gotta... I gotta craft everything, man. Has to be done. Right? Yeah, like... Oh, it's like No Man's Sky, but real life. That's kind of real. Oh, fuck. This thing has nothing. Oh, my. Wait. Thank you. Does, will my car ever look like badass? Or is it always going to look shit? Oh, the cars are getting harder to start up. Is that because it's kind of broken? It's injured.
Why don't we hear like fart? So really, maybe I don't want to drive it all the way in. I think I can carry this back. I'm not going to turn the car off either. What happens if you kick this thing? Oh, you can't. Alright. So, do like, weird things follow me around when I hold this? I think that's why the ground busted before. Yeah, weird shit follows me around. Cool. One more of you. Yeah, I see. Reality anchors. It's alright. This was planned. Look, look, look. It's a strat. Big strat. Big strat. Big strat. Movement. Wait. I'm fuck. I'm, I'm gonna put stuff away. Fuck it. All right. Yo, what's up, Chris? How you going? Oh, do I want to go through here? This looks bad. Hey, I shouldn't go through here, no? What happens if I skim a little bit? Let's see. You also follow me around. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean it. Didn't mean it. What happens if I reverse? I'm not going to go there. All right, so now I, I go to the I go to the uh, the gateways now, right? It's a gateway time. Let's see what the situation is. Wait, before we do though, nothing. All right. Oofed. 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 Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's alright, we're chilling, we're chilling. Oh wait, what was that? Red? Is it just here? Close. Do I gotta press something? Hello? Oh, right, right, right. I'm too close. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. Hold up, hold up. Well, I gotta go really far away. I'm even too far for that one. I key though, that's a, that's a whole ass car to scrap. Why is my car moving? Now, why would my car be doing that? Now, why would it be doing that? Grim Park, true. Yo, I'm, I'm gonna be frank, this game's guarded.
Is this what happens when you read in every game? No, surely not, right? Reading can't be that powerful. Seems pretty cool, right? I know they're using the flare gun. Oh shit, I moved it the wrong way. Even fly? Okay, that's good, that's good. I mean, okay, this this replace parts goal. Collect them collect materials and craft replacement parts. I don't really have to do that, right? That's just like just in case. If I feel like it. I can always do that when I get back. Okay, I see that one's ready, but I'm gonna go for the one I went to initially. The train is pulling out the station. The wind is blowing us away, somebody. Stop. This is a forka. Like, I'm not gonna get like an achievement or something, right? Cause like, it looks like the car parts I can make a shit. Yo, what's up, Josh? How are you? Like, where, where does this panel go? Crude panel? Oh, I haven't even got anything on. Oh, I didn't even realize that one was completely missing. Oh, wow. Wow, I really was driving a piece of junk. Oh my god, okay. What else am I missing? <laughs> I'm doing good. Uh, we're playing this game for the first time. It's been pretty good so far. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see. Is that a panel as well? Actually, throwing, man. This is my baby, man. All right, then what? Like a, 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 a boot door, right? Hold on. Headlights, spare tire. Can I get like a trunk door? Fuel, battery, engines. It, the boot door is any door? Ha. Very, very cool. Um, what else am I missing? <laughs> Watch my head now, bro. <laughs> Can I actually... <laughs> am I taking damage? Oh my god, I thought I was dying. I am! I am taking damage! Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. What else am I missing, huh? Spare tire. Spare tire. Summer tire. Summer tire. Is the summer tire bad, guys? Is the spare tire better than the summer? I can't even tell. I mean, it's telling me to craft replacement parts right now, but I can't even, like... Will this give me more information? Any more information here, huh? I feel like I've done enough. Unless it wants me to paint it. In the dashboard mirror. Oh, let's have a look. Like here? Wait. Dashboard monitor. Grayed out. A headlight! Thank you, thank you. Aha! Damn! He's got like a bit of a, a, a oogly googly eye going on there. Fair enough. Alright, we're on the road. And then what? And then I'm hitting this? Wait. Link gateway. Storm warning. What the fuck is- Drive? Oh shit, my bad. You see that glowing pillar into the sky? Drive into it. Yes, it looks like half death, but it's so much better than getting scrambled by the instability. 
Okay. <laughs> this is sick. What happens if I jump out last second? Flashbang. Oh! Cool. Trip report. An hour. 3.85 miles. Oh, well, well. Stable unstable. You're alive. I'm Thank you. certain if the zone didn't get you, that gateway would. Hmm. Did I not mention that you're the first human I've sent through that thing? I mean, they've been rodents, but <laughs> it's not like it's completely untested. But anyway, it worked. So, you should have made it back with everything you collected out there. That's the beauty of the gateway. It's the only way to get back with all your marbles intact. I parked badly. Now, take those parts you found into the back room. I'll let you use my fabrication station. For now. That station will concoct ways for you to rig up anything from roof racks to flare guns. Assembling an antenna with those parts you brought back should be easy as pie. But it requires anchor juice to work its magic, so bring back as many as you can. And just because I haven't used that garage in decades doesn't mean you can trash the place. Mess up my equipment and I'll throw you to the anomaly so quick you'll get whiplash. We clear? Okay, cool. Yo, what's up, Panda? How are you? Okay, we just charged our car and used our, um... Thing or wait. Can I not? Wait, did I have a key? Hold on. Oh, it's an impact hammer I need. What was here? I gotta deposit my paints. Hold on. Ah! 95% done with the tutorial. They teach you, like, just enough, I think. Okay. So, these... This is my skill tree. No? Yes? It's a garage. What the... Oh, hell! This is crazy. Blueprint materials. Cobble... Cobble together using equipment from Oppie's vault and scavenged spare parts. This will sweep the zone to detect pockets of instability. Oh, it's a scanning antenna. Matter deconstructor? There are, there's 12? Wait, they're lying. Oh, okay, no, it's a sorting. Right, okay, but these, these are, there's 12 here, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, fuck. All right, so let's see, so uh, garage, this is like refining stuff, so what has teeth and a bite but no jaw? Probably a lot of things, actually. This gear is one of them. So these are blueprints to make gears, right? Or unlocked? Install the scanning. Okay, so I need the scanning antenna to like install a bunch of other stuff. So let's do that. Scanning antenna kit. Installation kit. Install the antenna on the roof? Motherfucker, what? All right. How do I get up there? Can I throw the antenna up there? I'm going to break this shit. Oh, whoa, whoa. It's pretty cool, yeah? Hey, your ISP? Oh, yeah. How was the whole internet thing today? Oh, I thought that shit was going to be, like, in my head. Antenna signals coming through loud and clear. Give it a moment to initialize. Okay. Offer a tire? Okay, that's actually... That sounds like a really good idea already. Maybe break that open. Dude, the one thing I don't like about the game so far is that little sound when you get like a new quest thing. I'm probably going to ruin that sound for everyone, but it sounds like the start of when you push to mute on Discord and you have sounds uh, on. It sounds like I'm fucking push to muting. Handbrake. Where did that just go? Install the handbrake. Okay. That's actually really handy. No pun intended. It does, yeah. Make sure to empty your trunk before heading back out. This? You'll need the space. Transfer trunk empty. Can 
can I put this anywhere? Like, is this... Is this just like uh, storage? And we're patched. Everything's in working shape. Oh, sorry. I've hooked up the antenna to the route planner. Give it a look after you're done peeping through my garage. Crude panel. Crude bumper. Got some healing shit. Scrap metal. Do I just take it all? Hand vac. Oh, wait. I can vacuum my car? Hold on. Dude. Can I vacuum the car? Wait. Did I just drop the bar? Wait, I think I just dropped the pry bar on oh, no. it. I just threw it. Whoops. What do I need a vacuum? <laughs> so Luigi, Luigi's mansion army uh, loot, right? Okay. D can I upgrade anything else? Because I, uh, I was a good boy and I grabbed all the energy. Repair party. Better headlights. I mean, the tire is probably right. Off for a tire. I okay. I, I have two point eight stable. Oh, okay, I can do this. Summer tire. So the summer tire was better than the spare tire. It has 50 more health. Off-road rating is double A. Okay. I just remembered the whole thing. Oppies, what's this? What is a Numa tube? What the fuck? Let me see. The Numa tubes, also known as the tubes, span the zone. A low-tech, low-maintenance method of communication and delivery. Oh, so you can, like, deliver stuff to the zone? What is this? Hello? Decal kit? Do I want to be using them or saving them? Autovac. What are these transfer trunks? Is that like a way of quickly looting stuff? What's the point of inventing all these new technologies if you can't use them? Wait, right, what's going on? I'm pressing shit, man. What's up, dub? Hold the trunk, go to your trunk, pick it all up, and I'll... Oh, okay, okay. This is a spare tire. Hold on. I mean, it's empty anyway. Okay, but that's what I normally do. How much did I just spend just then, by the way, on that wheel stuff? I can make it. Okay. Stable energy. 2.3. 1. Fighting for your life right now on the pooper. Crocs are off and toesy grip in the... Insane, man. That's insane, but I, I wish you the best of luck. I'm confused by this thing. This thing's kind of confused me, but... Okay, I've got 0 0.8 now. Okay, we have uh, off-road tires, all-terrain tires. The off-road tires... do a lot better off the road, but that's... I mean, that's obvious, but that's what we want. How come it gave me a summer tire before? In, out... Okay, there's a lot. Dude, we're playing this new game right now. It's been really fun, but it's at the same time, you know... Kind of confusing. But I'm a good, can't complain. So, where do I put the trash? Like, actually in the trash? Spare tire. Can I recycle these things? Off-road oh, tire. I need gears. Um, I can craft gears, though, thankfully. Oh, let's go. All right. Ah, the matter disassembler. Okay, I don't think I can use that yet, though, right? Yo, Spence. How have you been, bro? What the fuck? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I'm missing ingredients. I'm trolling. Oh, I need gears. That's all I need.
Right, and then this will convert everything into raw materials for me, I assume. I presume. Let's see. Energy efficient, economical, and probably even ethical. The matter deconstructor will recycle car components in seconds. Do not... Do be careful to not get your hands caught in the suspension matrix. So I just hit him with the... Yeet! What? Can I not just throw it in? Oh. I, I don't understand the purpose of that vacuum. Is that just if I have like a shit ton of stuff on the ground, the vacuum will automatically just like clean it up? What's up, Light? How are you, man? Welcome, welcome. Oh, rubber's super handy. All right, let's take the other wheels off. We're going to make all the off-road tires. I do assume I need to... Yeah, I'm going to have to... A garage Roomba. Okay, okay. Oh. I keep pressing the wrong button. I'm stupid. Whoa, whoa, whoa chill. I'm stupid, I'm stupid. Yep. Well, uh, like it goes the whole va garage? Wait, no way. Oh, I thought it was just this room, man. Okay, and then I pick it up. Holy shit. Holy shit, streamer is learning. Have you guys ever seen a streamer learn at this rate? Where the fuck? Wait, where, where's my transfer trunk? There's nothing in here. What the fuck? Wait, hold on. Oh, oh hold on, hold on. I didn't grab the stuff out. Wait a second. It's empty. Why? What the fuck? All right, never mind. This game is called Pacific Drive. I assume that was everything. Yeah, can I throw this trunk out? Considering it's empty. Or will it just always respawn? I guess it'll respawn in the, the location. Okay, that's fine. Alright, um... Yeah, it's like a, uh, it's like a survival... So far, it's been a survival game where I have been, like, uh, transported into this zone where we don't know what the hell is going on. So we're trying to figure out what's going on. And one of the biggest, like, gameplay mechanics has been this car. So I'm driving this car around. And I'm slowly upgrading it. So there we go. We have a car with off-road tires now. Um, let's have a look here as well. Is it, uh, I think I probably have not enough. Um, shit, I want to make this, the steel panels better. Yeah, I don't have enough energy. I have no unstable energy. Now, okay, with paint jobs, let's just say I wanted to give the car a paint job. How, how does that work? Like, like, can I, can I only equip a paint job once? Like, let me have a look. Am I throwing if I use it now on this shitty, on this shitty vehicle? Would I be trolling? Waste on crew battle? Okay, okay, I'm not gonna do it. Alright. Well. This looks fucked up. Uh, also, okay, so is this, is repair putty, if I don't have the time or resources to perform extensive repairs, so that makes it sound like the repair putty is the worst way to repair something, like it's very, very, if the, if I just can't do anything. Is the other option just completely making new doors? Drive a door, uh, they're still, yeah, those ones look a little bit better. It seems as though I just have to make... Oh, no, mechanics kit. Hold on. Right, scrapping and remaking. Okay. Holes and leaks, bro.
We make one mechanic kit. I just want to see what, what the fuck this means. Oh, so this is wheel and engine. I mean, there's nothing wrong with my engine, so I guess it's... It's fine. Hmm, yeah, like this crude panel. Although, hold on, I... Oh, no, I didn't have the setting where it just automatically fixed everything. Maybe I turned that setting on where my car gets automatically fixed upon revisiting. It would definitely take away from some of the survival element, but I guess it would make the game go faster. All right. Um, I just realized I've had a, a checklist this entire time. Use the transfer trunk to unload collected. I, is this like some kind of achievement? Battery jumper. I saw the new map is in rank today. Dude, I was playing Storm. I played two games of Storm Point yesterday and I really enjoyed that. Dude, the checklists are actually super handy. I'm not VPN right now though. I kind of threw, man. That means like, I can't get on Apex on stream. Okay, that's the car 100%. Tend to my wounds at the first aid station. Right, and you just insta heal from here. Beautiful. Battery jumper. Repair putty. Did I have the battery jumper in here? Nope. Something I can craft. Battery jumper. Electronics. Where the fuck do I find electronics? Uh, let's see. Wait. Yeah, Broken Moon. It's pretty bad. I, I haven't been minding it too much, but Broken Moon is definitely where I lose the most LP. Car right back respawns each time as well. This little guy. I have fun on Broken Moon, but it's because I just like insta die every time. Wait, so. Okay, so this is this is good, I guess. It's like a little a little farm we have. Oh, and you can always come and get like your flares and stuff. Okay. Or siphon a bit. I mean, you don't need to siphon fuel though, I guess. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, I feel that. It's still, it's still not ideal. At least there's, I don't know, I feel like it's this time right now in Apex, it's not like, not like other, other seasons where I felt like, holy shit, I do not want to play that map. It's normally just I don't want to play the game. Yeah. And we'll do a little bit of this. And then we'll probably wrap up this mod here. Yeah. Maybe that's actually a bad thing, though. <laughs> the fact that it's... I don't want to play Apex instead of I don't want to play this map. Aha. Uh -huh. So there was a TV around, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, PC. Right. Okay, so we have electronic parts now. So... Oh, we have a pearl in the, in the trunk? Oh, oh. Wait, in here? <laughs> Oh, no, hold on, you're right. Wait, the pearl I had. What do you even do with this? Uh, I just throw this shit out, no? Wait, let me scan it. Well, I can't even use this thing.
The randoms are insane, man. Oh. This thing doesn't seem to be working. Oh! Can I not use this thing here? On Prime Gaming? Oh, yeah, my friends are telling me about that. That's a goaded game. Oh, I can use it in here, but not out here. Oh. What's the best one? Did I, did I have a good... Purple's the best one? All right. Is that purple? Wait, that shit looks... No, that's like green. Oh, I hit it anyway. Fuck. Oh, I got it on the first try, dude. Oh, my God. What's the second best one? <laughs> I thought it was green. I was like, oh, that's purple. Gold? Is that gold or red? That's gold, yeah? Can I get purple again in the same rotation or am I pushing my luck? Dude, this thing's kind of annoying to use because... Actually, no, it, it... I just held it for too long. I held it for too long. Harder to roll again? All right, I'll just go with gold. We'll go with gold. All right, now we know at least. I think if you hadn't told me, I would have thrown it in the first one without changing it, so... What the fuck would purple have given me, man? A light bulb. Damn, all right. This game is cool. It's really, really good. I hope you're doing well today, Platt. Chemicals? Oh, okay. It's fine. We crafted those chemicals earlier, remember? True. Wait, wait what did I just craft? The battery jumper. I mean, this is just like in case. Should, I should keep that with me, right? Transfer trunk to unload collected materials. I mean, I'm not going to be able to do that, like... Uh, I'm not gonna do that. I don't have any other materials to, uh, to like, collect. Cool. Alright. We might end the VOD here. I have very much enjoyed this, though. One to two troops instead of five. Yeah. I mean, I could, like, just take everything out of the car, right? And then... Do it for the achievement. I mean, there's probably no achievement, right? Um, okay. What does... What, what is... Find my way to town? I'll, I'll do that another time. Hung the horn? Alright, we'll do. We'll do. Oh, what's, hap what's happening here? Change ability. Handbrake. Skill on demand. Oh, bad. Okay, okay. Replace car. I mean, I don't have one. Oh, what is this? Control, though? No, hold on. Can I clear? Very cool. Handbrake on... On that. F? I think that has to be E. I think we have to change that to E. Control... Because kick is E. Interact F. Maybe it's fine. This could be one of those games where it's... Oh, no, no. Bindings in the car. F E Okay, cool. Don't forget to save. It auto says when you loop back, but not uh, all progress in the garage. Okay, so I have to save. Very cool, man. Very, very cool. All right, we'll call the uh, the VOD there. Guys, if you want to check this video out in 1440p, exclamation mark VODs, check out the VOD channel. You can find everything there, everything we play. So this will be episode one. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That was really fun. We'll continue playing through this. I think this will be our game until... I mean, there's not really any story games coming out. 